literacy time. Are you ready to do some writing? And do you have everything ready? You should have a place that you can sit down and write at a table and have your two worksheets and, um, and your writing tool. Okie dokie. Okay, before we do our writing exercises, let's work on our alphabet sounds. Now this one I'm gonna show you the picture of the sound and then we're gonna do the alphabet without the picture. So we're trying to pack this into our suitcase to take to kindergarten. We hope that when we get to kindergarten we'll know all of our letters and sounds. Alrighty, maybe you already do. Good job. And if you're still working on it, this is an awesome time to practice. Okay, are you ready? Set, go. T says, good. J says, good. P says, good. I heard some people say pop, but just p good. I says, good. A says, ah, like you're going to say, ah, choo. L says, ooh, don't really lick your fingers, okay? K says, out of the back of your throat. R says, like a pirate. And O says, ah. And S says, S -s -s good. D says, D -d -d. remember, not da. W. B says, b -b -b. not ba, but b -b. H says, for your hot breath. V, like vibrate. U says, look up. M, rub your tummy. M, Z, buzz like a bee. Q is K and W sound. Kwa, kwa, kwa. N, push your nose. N, G, G, and Good. X, K, and S together. K, S, K, S. Unless it's the beginning of a word, it's going to say Z. All right. E, A, F, feel it. C, K. That's our lowercase letter today. And Y, this is the hardest one, I think. Yeah. Yarn, yo, yo, you. Excellent. Okay, now these are all in order, so I'm going to have to mix them up. Okay, let's go through these. No pictures this time, guys, okay? 26 letters. No pictures. Give me the sound. I'm going to time you guys this time. Ready? Stop. Watch. Set. Whoops. All right, go. C says, good. D says, good. E says, good. F says, good. V says, good. W says, excellent. X says, Y says, Z says, A says, A went flying. A says, B says, G says, I says, J says, K says, L says, M says, N says, O says, P says, Q says, R says, S says, T says, U says, and stop. One minute 12. If I remember right, you were one minute 17. You guys are getting so fast. Way to go. Your letters and sounds are coming together. Round of applause. Okay, now boys and girls, 
for a few weeks, we are going to be making letters that are that look just like the capital letters. So it's almost as if the capital letter jumped into the dryer and then shrunk. It's made the same. It's just smaller. It's half the size. And when we make our lowercase letters this week for lowercase Lee, see, we're going to be using two lines. There's one line, and here's the other line. Then I'm going to pick a different color. We're going to take our lowercase c and make it in between the two lines, touching the top, top and touching the bottom, just like it's daddy or mommy uppercase c, which is going to be twice as big. Lowercase c kind of fits right next to its, its bigger um, capital. So lowercase c looks the same, is made the same way. We call it a magic c, and it goes in between the two lines. But see how I'm touching here? And I'm touching there. So let's look at our sheet, magic c, and take your finger and trace over magic c one time. And then we have one, two, and then here you start by yourself, five total. So one, two, tracing, and then one, two, three, by yourself. And I want you to try the best you can to stay between those lines. That's really kind of forcing you to keep your letters small. And do you remember how we talked about when we go to kindergarten, we're trying to get our names smaller and smaller? Well, not only are we going to start writing them smaller, but we're actually going to start using lowercase letters. I'm not kidding. You're going to shock the socks off your kindergarten teacher if you write your name with lowercase letters. The first letter is always capital because you're a very important person. So your first letter will be capital, but the rest of the letters in your name, we're going to learn to write them lowercase. Some of you are already doing that, but I think a lot of us are really going to be shocked at how easy it's going to be. So, and then if you can color your cat, that would be awesome. Maybe make it a calico cat or a black cat or a Persian cat, whatever you like to do. Now we have C words. Here we go. The first word, when we look at the picture clue, is good job, cow. The second word, look at the picture for a clue, cat, excellent. Now here, the third picture, C is using the S sound. Sometimes it borrows from S. This is a tough one. City. City. If you notice the city, city C is using S's sound for that one. And then the fourth word is, look at the picture for a clue. Good job cloud. Boys and girls, if you could trace magic C four times, one, two, three, four. Don't use a marker like Teacher Shelley. Please use a crayon or pencil. That's all you have to do on this page. Okay. Ah, sorry about that, guys. <laughs>